Jonathan. Indiana has been given a green light from the president to not follow all No Child Left Behind requirements. News Channel 15's edu education reporter Elizabeth Fields joins us now from News Control. So what does it mean for students and schools here? Well, Heather, it's a little bit too soon to tell exactly, but there are some ideas already floating out there by lots of different people about what they would like to see. No Child Left Behind was passed in 2001, and it was supposed to bring accountability to schools by putting emphasis on standardized testing. If the schools failed, they faced sanctions, sanctions some of our local school districts faced at one point. But the president's waiver gives the power back to the state government and local districts as long as they come up with their own way to improve scores and track progress. The goals of No Child Left Behind were the right ones. We've got to stay focused on those goals, but we've got to do it in a way that doesn't force teachers to teach to the test or encourage schools to lower their standards to avoid being labeled as failures. State Superintendent Tony Bennett said in a statement, quote, Indiana will take advantage of the flexibility we have been granted with this waiver by continuing to pursue policies that produce better academic outcome for our children. Members of the Indiana State Teachers Association are hopeful the waivers will give them some breathing room, but are nervous about what Bennett meant about taking advantage of the waiver. The president of the ISTA says it's important that the Indiana Department of Education be committed to the spirit of this waiver to bring about real school reform that works for Hoosier students. Access to early education, well-rounded instruction, safe and supportive learning environments, and access to caring and qualified teachers. I also talked with a local ISTA member on the phone today, and he told me that he is happy about the waiver because he, he says now maybe student progress could also be used to, to, or student growth rather, could be tracked rather than just test scores. Reporting live tonight from News Control, I'm Elizabeth Fields, News Channel 15.